I go back and fact check everything that Trump claims that he has accomplished. I would say 98% of the things he is saying are not true. And I think if you're going to be a leader, you need to tell the truth. I am Dale and I am from North Carolina. So in 2016 and also 2020, I did vote for Trump. But this year in 2024, I am voting for Harris. What he's attempting to do is tap in to evangelicals to get them to come over to his side of the fence to vote for him. He himself claims to be a believer, but his rhetoric and his behavior is so contrary to what I see in the scriptures. And I think if you're going to be a Christian and claim to be a Christian, you need to live what you say you are. Republicans have always believed in the rule of law, and we've always endorsed traditions. But when Trump did what he did on the Capitol and also tried to subvert an election, he basically was sending a message that it's okay to subvert the law. I can't support someone who wants to just subvert the law. I go back and fact check everything that Trump claims that he has accomplished. I would say 98% of the things he's saying are not true. And I think if you're going to be a leader, you need to tell the truth.